Hey, hey, and welcome to another Tech Tuesday. This is Chad from Ascension Worship. This week we're talking about getting more practice. Hey, 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 what do you say? Yes, it's that time again. It's Tech Tuesday. My apologies for not being around for the past few weeks. You may be able to tell from my voice, but it's uh, a little gravelly today. Uh, I've been sick for the past three weeks um, with uh, sickness and allergy issues and uh, just haven't quite got my voice back, but I didn't want to go any longer without being able to give you guys some uh, some cool stuff this week. Um, so this week we're talking about getting more practice and uh, kind of getting out of your your shell a little bit. Some of the things that have really helped me um, in my time doing audio stuff is um, I've been able to get a lot of experience, uh, not just in one church with one band, um, but I was lucky enough to work in a live music venue, <clears throat> excuse me, where, um, you know, anytime that I would mix, there'd be usually at least four bands of different kinds of style, um, different, uh, uh, I'd have to work really quickly to uh, to get sound checks for them and learn how to do things fast. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, and also I got to do some studio work. Well, not all of us are lucky enough to be able to um, to work in different venues with different bands, um, but we all are able to do some form of um, in the box studio work. And what I mean by that is uh, there are some really cool DAWs or DAWs, Digital Audio Workstations, uh, available to you. And for those of us who have uh, digital mixers, it's easier than ever to do a uh, 32-track recording uh, of your band that you can play with at home. Now, we've done videos in the past, and I'll link those to the um, for us to be able to go back and see how to do that. Um, but for some of us that are... Um, for whatever reason, unable to do that, or that hasn't been that helpful for us, uh, today I've got some free resources for you, especially if you work with analog mixers. I want to give you um, 25, um, let me just my mic here, 25 free uh, tracks that we have um, that are for a song that we recorded uh, last year. Uh, it's a city worship tune that you can check out. Um, and so you can drop this into a digital audio workstation and really mess with the things that we've been talking about when it comes to EQ, compression, uh, all that good stuff, and really kind of develop your ear uh, from home uh, before you get to your church. And then you'll have a better idea when you're in your live environment where it's harder to tell exactly what that compressor is doing to that kick. You will have a little bit better experience from home that you can then apply to your church. Um, so in here, I've got some files loaded up into um, a program that I like called Logic. Um, <clears throat> Logic is really cool. It allows you to do a lot of stuff, definitely all the things that we've talked about here. A lot of my videos um, show the EQ and the compression from Logic. Um, so really cool program. It's $200, um, but it comes with everything you need to, um, to mix and master, uh, to do editing, to make your own music. It's really cool. Now, if that's not something that you need or you don't want to spend $200, I completely understand it. So we also have some free resources for you today. Um, <clears throat> first one up is uh, Studio One 3 Prime. Uh, this is the free limited version of Studio One. Um, maybe a Personas. A lot of you guys might have Personas mixers at your church. Um, really cool DAW. It's uh, very up and coming in the past few years. Well, this is just the stripped down free version of it, um, but it should be more than enough for you guys to practice with. Uh, there's also Reaper. Now, from everything I've read, Reaper is not 100% free. Uh, however, it is free to try. And if you like it, it's uh, only $60 for most of us to use in our church. Um, so all the links to all these things will be in your uh, in the description of this video. Uh, and like I said, we've got 25 um, files that are ready for you to drop into your DAW of choice. Um, and this is uh, pretty much everything that most of our churches either have or might want to have. So we've got a full drum kit. 
um, with uh, two kick mics, two snare mics, overheads, and two tom mics. Uh, bass guitar, that's me playing with just a single uh, single line because I'm awesome that way. Just kidding. Um, we've got three guitar tracks. One of them is in stereo. One of them is in mono. Two acoustic tracks, keys. We've got a tracks rig that has some stems. So there's a stereo track. There's percussion, a pre-recorded guitar track, cues, MD. Um, we've got just a single vocal for this channel, for this song, excuse me. And then we've even got some room mics that you can play around with. Um, so some cool stuff in there. Again, totally free. Link will be in the description. Hope this is helpful for you and for your church. Uh, like always, please like, subscribe, share. Um, all these resources are free. So if you uh, know other churches that could benefit from this, please feel free to share that with them. We want to make sure this is a positive impact for the local church. Uh, so until next time, have a great week. Again, this is Chad from Ascension Worship. I hope this has been helpful for you and your team. Come back here every Tuesday for new information.